Hey guys, it's Bodie with IPTVWire.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to block ads on any Walmart on Google TV device or Android TV devices in general. Now to be fully transparent, there is no way to block all ads, but these tips and tricks I'm going to show you in this video will help you limit the ads that you see. Now, obviously ads are one of the most frustrating aspects of people using streaming devices and streaming services. So I wanna make this video to you know help you guys out on how you can limit ads and improve your overall streaming experience. So guys, the first thing we can do is hover over the settings icon on the right, click the settings icon, and then scroll down and click privacy. The very first thing I would suggest doing is making sure that your location status is turned off. As you'll see, my location status is turned off. That's number one. The next thing guys, if you scroll down to ads and click ads, you'll see that you have a specific advertising ID. So what you can do is you can click delete advertising ID, click delete advertising ID again, and now your advertising ID is deleted. So now what's going to happen is you will not get served, you know, personalized and relevant ads uh, without an advertising ID. So that is a, a tip number one here. Uh, the next thing you can do guys is scroll down and click special app access. And then if you scroll down and click usage access, you can turn off all of these different usage accesses. So like it reads here, usage, usage access allows an app to track what other apps you're using and how often. So this is a way that Google is able to serve you ads on your Android TV devices. So I'm going to turn off Google Play Store, Google Play Services, Google TV, and also Google. So that's another quick tip for limiting ads. And guys, the final thing that you can do to block ads on your Android TV device is to make sure that you are using an ad blocker. Now, Surfshark VPN has the best ad blocker available, which is called CleanWeb. And you do need to be a paid subscriber to Surfshark VPN in order to use their CleanWeb ad blocker. I do have a special discount link below this video that will get you the best discount on Surfshark VPN, and it does help support myself and this channel. So guys, I'm going to show you clean web in action here. It's like it reads, clean web blocks ads, trackers, malware when your VPN is connected. So you'll see I am connected to clean web and now I'm going to launch a web browser. So I'm launching a web browser called TV Bro. This is just a free browser I found in the Google Play Store, but you can use any web browser. So to test this out, I just wanna to go to a website that's commonly you know, riddled with ads. So in this example, what I'm going to do is I'm just gonna to go to ESPN.com. So if I type in ESPN.com, you know, and guys, you can also use any website that typically has a lot of ads. Think of like Yahoo.com, CNN, Fox, you know, things of that nature. So I'm gonna type in ESPN.com, click go. And now while this is loading, I'm very curious to see if Surfshark's clean web feature is going to block some of these ads that you would typically see on a site like ESPN.com. And so far it looks like it is, as if you go to ESPN.com on another device such as your desktop or you know even phone, you would typically see a big ad right here towards the top. As you'll see, there's a lot of blank space. That's because there's usually a giant ad above the fold that appears right there. So it looks like so far, the clean web feature is blocking the ads on ESPN.com. And if I scroll down, I have yet to see an ad pop up or you know even ad on the sidebar. Um, so it appears the Surfshark clean web yeah, feature is working to block ads on ESPN.com or any website that you wanna access in general. So that's it guys. That is how you block ads on your, any, on your Walmart on Google TV box or any Android TV device. Again, this is Bodie with IPTV Wire. Be sure to subscribe to my channel if this video helped you out. Drop me a like, drop me a comment below. Let me know what you guys think, and I hope you all have a great day.